to Sea Sessions 2011. We're going to go have a look at the town, see what it's got on offer over the weekend, show you the festival site, show you the campsite. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So follow us on this tour. Some campers arrived last night and um, we're going to go and have a bit of a look as to what to expect once you get here. Come on, follow me. Okay, so um, over here to your right, um, we've got um, barbecues, so sausages, burgers, that kind of thing. Um, back over here, we've got none other than um, Ocean Cafe at Sea Sessions, where would you get it? Um, nice little bit of cafe culture for you here in the campsite. If we come down this way a little bit, um, relentless guys, you need energy, they're the guys you need to go to. Um, some crepes, pancakes, um, Basically, you won't go hungry in this campsite. That's the main idea behind it. As you can see, um, lots of space, plenty of space for you guys arriving over the weekend. We've got a few campers that have arrived already. You can see all the little tents set up. So the grass is nice and dry. No mud baths for us at Sea Sessions this year. So yay. Okay, so there you have it. You've just had a tour of our brand new campsite. And uh, now we're gonna throw it over to Pete Craig, one of the organizers of Sea Sessions. And he's gonna tell you what to expect and when to expect, hopefully, the Quicksilver Expression Session. Okay, well, we've got an expression session uh, with the surf contest. Very hard for us to always schedule it, but I mean, that's the nature of the surf. Uh, the idea of our competition is that it's, got, it's, it's only going to take three hours so we can really maximise the conditions which really attracts the surfers rather than all day events. Uh, it looks like we're going to have good waves on Sunday so that it looks like it's going to happen sometime on Sunday. We're going to try and flag it to people as much as possible but if you don't get there we'll put it up online so you can watch it afterwards. I think it's more important that we get good waves than scheduling it to a certain time. Right now we're standing right outside the main entrance to the sea sessions festival site. Over to the right is where you can get your tickets, your little wristbands um, on your way in. And if you're wondering where the entrance is, if you haven't been here before, um, it's literally off the main street and opposite the wharf bar. Um, so let's go on in there and uh, have a little sneak peek as to what's going on. Um, this is where the artists are going to be hanging out over the weekend. So the likes of the delays, Ziggy Marley, Bell X1, um, Roy7, uh, who else do we have? Lots of other guys. All the guys you're going to be checking out over the weekend, this is where they're going to be hanging out. Um, so just a very quick walk through. In here to the left are the dressing rooms. Um, so there's um, about six dressing rooms in all. And as you can imagine, there's quite a lot of artists here over the weekend and they need to be in and out of those dressing rooms like yo-yos. So the artist liaison girls are going to be dealing with all of that. Um, so there's Aoife, one of the artist liaison girls. Um, so quickly follow down here and we'll give you a sneak peek. Now they're all under build. Um, they've got lots of nice comfy seating. There's going to be lots more lights and um, kind of furnishings and everything like that going in there. And where we're currently standing at the moment, um, there's going to be lots of little picnic tables tables and lights and candles and it's going to be all very comfy and romantic and um, very nice. Um, okay so the most exciting part of this area I have to say they're that VIP we can't actually even get into them at this stage are the VIP toilets. Gold taps in there apparently I heard. Um, okay so moving on swiftly we're going to go back to one of our top tips of what you should get up to in Bundoran over the festival weekend. So over to Richie Fitzgerald from Surf World and star of Wave Riders. Well, there's plenty to do in Bundoran but my top recommendation if you're spending the weekend for the sea sessions here in Bundoran is to go and have a pint of Guinness in Brennan's bar on the main street the oldest, most authentic bar in the town. It's been in the same family for over 150 years. They've won the prize for the best pint of Guinness in Ireland five times, I think, over the last 20 years. Phenomenal service, a great bar, and fantastic Guinness. I couldn't recommend it higher. Festival site, um, a little bit different to last year, but there are some similarities. So over to my right over here, we've got the main stage. So acts like Ziggy Marley, Bell X1, um, Charles Bradley, uh, Japanese pop stars, all those guys are gonna be over there. And if you just swing over here to my left, we've got the North Shore stage. So acts like Codes, Ham Sandwich, Roy7, um, you can see all these guys over here. So great thing about it, across the road. You know, you want to catch five minutes over here, five minutes over there, whatever the hell you want to do, you can do it. So if your favourite bands are on at the same time, don't worry, 
two seconds, you're over. Um, okay, so follow me a little bit down here. Um, over just behind me, you can see that we have our gourmet food area. Um, so, you know, you can get your usual, your burgers, your chips, uh, kebabs. Um, what else do we have? We've got the Eco Bus, which are back this year as well. And there's a bit of healthy food in there for you too. Um, so what are we gonna do now? We're gonna go over to Alan, who is one of the surf instructors in Bundoran Surf Company, who's been living in Bundoran for a couple of years now. And he's gonna give you your top tip of what to do over the weekend. Top thing to do in Bundoran over the sea sessions weekend would have to be come into Bundoran Surf Co, grab a surf lesson with us. We'll take you down and show you the ropes. And you never know, in a few years, if it all goes well, you could be living the dream down here on a Monday morning, paddling out to the peak while all the other people head back to Dublin and go to work. Right, now we are in the Relentless Energy Drink Jump Show area. Um, so we had a bit of this last year, but let me tell you, this year is bigger and better than ever. Um, right behind me is the Titan Half Pipe. So massive these guys are going to be blading bmxing skating they're going to be doing turns airs literally risking life and limb for you guys the spectators so that you have an amazing show to watch um the energy or the relentless energy drink area is going to be linking through to the rage stage and then to the jump show area um so yeah come watch the guys um right over here just behind me um we walk over here we've got the bacardi uh, beach bar area so um, if you want to get some mojitos a few cocktails all the Bacardi mixologists are going to be on site for you this is brand new for us at sea sessions um, so yeah so let's get over here um, take a seat I don't think anyone's around to serve me a drink quite yet um, so still getting ready so that's it um, we've come to the end of our little tour. You've seen a bit of Bundoran, you've seen the campsite, you've seen the festival site where the stages are at, a bit of the artist area, um, and you've had those top tips of what to do whilst you're here. Um, so all I've got to say is goodbye from us and enjoy sea sessions. So over and out.